Um, what about y your own? Let, aside from the cases, we can go back to them later. But in your own in your own ranks, how do you prevent corruption? Uh, it's very easy. Very hard. Yeah. <laughs> very hard. Um, a lot of with a lot of will, I would say. Um, I'm so hard headed. I am a straight shooter. I'm so taray. So. Um, if I have to, to, to do one thing, then I really make sure that it's done, mm -hmm. okay? Uh, so we've been moving people around, okay? Uh, Siyempre, I have some information naman on, on, on how they've been uh, performing in the past. Yes. And what strategic partnerships they may have had with, uh, with, with, with people that are less than uh, candid, if I may say. Yes. Um, and uh, you have a bureaucracy you said 8,500 yes, yes, 8, people how do you make sure that your ranks the police or the, the people who are supposed to police are also clean correct correct it's very difficult kasi nga uh, nandun na yun eh pero yun, as I said uh, we just have to do it so moving them around of course I get calls yes. I get uh, from politicians and all that na oh wag mo namang ano wag mo namang ilipat ito, pwede bang itong auditor na to ang ilagay mo sa amin, etc. Eh, pag ganun, talagang lalong tumataas ang kilay ko. Ba't, ba't kayo nihingi? You know? <laughs> so, I, I, I actually announced to everyone that um, please refrain from getting endorsements. No? Uh, if you want to be promoted, let your merit speak for yourself. Fantastic. Because it's, it's us who know you better than anyone from outside. And, uh, I've been sticking to that. For me, because reliability, credibility is very important. Fantastic. Yeah. And I've not been making any exceptions because I think if I do make an exception, because it's in my uh, within my prerogative, na manan. Yes. Uh, wala, wala not, uh, you, you know, the, the people will not trust me anymore that uh, I'm there to do what I think should be done, what I think should be done. So Fantastic. Yeah. Let me throw some questions coming in from oh. social media. This is from at Ruvin Serrano. Which mm -hmm. government agency has the highest corruption record? Uh, from the point of view of COA? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, but I cannot say because when <laughs> we do make an audit, we do not use the term corruption. Uh, we, we look at how does the funds were spent or misspent right. or you know but that what about the, this the corruption rephrasing yeah. it which agency seems to have the highest number of anomalies of, of in terms of transactions yes uh, hmm the usual suspects okay nandun na yun sa, sa ranking usually yung mga ganon customs the, the normal ones that you uh, yeah the about. usual uh, the usual, <laughs> the usual. Um, and and then how do you deal with this i mean do they get special attention or do you do you try to strategically how do you look at the work that you do at what co is doing um we there's really no special attention in the sense of oh this year i will audit you oh, hindi ganun kasi lahat ng ahensya no audit namin every year mm -hmm. but then there are cases big cases that you know transactions uh, that come out and so we will have to intensify our audit of these transactions to make sure mm -hmm. that we cover all ground uh, and then uh, sometimes the audit focus will just have to shift from one to another but basically lahat yan, um, I would say equal attention this is from at NJ Maldito. I guess corruption starts in a system with inefficient processes. Make processes with minimal waste, lesser corruption. How how does that work? That when is, I, I agree. I, I I would agree with that. Uh, less uh, less is more. You know. Less is more. Yeah. Less yeah. is more. Because for example, in procurement, we have a lot of problems in procurement. Yes. And most of the time, most of our findings no, mm -hmm. have to do with uh, non-compliance mm -hmm. with uh, procurement requirements. Hindi nagpabid, o ganyan, 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 ganyan. Kasi if we look at the procurement law, talaga namang napaka-komplikado. Sometimes uh, it will take a year before anything can move. Yes. No, By that time, uh, iba na specifications mo na waste na yung pera. Kasi yes. uh, you'll get something less than ideal, yung mga ganon. And uh, there are really processes that would invite um, the occurrence of uh, graft. What lessons have you learned from when you went from PCGG in your career? What lessons do you take to COA today? What are you looking for? 
what am I looking for? Uh, you know, I live by the day, and uh, every time when I wake up, I just lift everything to God and ask for His guidance. Whatever comes my way, you know, I please be there to guide me. And uh, somehow, you know, decisions just come by very quickly. And what do I look for? Uh, that that things will be better, and that uh, the people will uh, begin to realize and appreciate that it's not all about being rich, it's not being about being powerful, but it is how we are using all of the resources, the opportunities that, that come our way every day uh, that really makes a difference. And uh, for me, that's just how I go about it. So let me ask you this one. You have roughly, this administration has, is halfway through its term, almost halfway through its term by next year. What do you want to accomplish in that time period? Uh, to accomplish that uh, the COA will uh, be a truly respected and dependable uh, independent commission. And that people who make a career in the COA will be most proud that they are in that institution and that the, God, that the people that we serve will also appreciate uh, and believe in uh, the work that, that we do for the public. You said 80% of the tips that you've gotten from the hotlines are, are actionable. Yes, um, yes. That's a great ratio. I guess your last yes. words, your last words. Yes. Uh, my last words. Um, for me, at the end of the day, it is how uh, it, it, it is really uh, how the citizens care about their government. It's uh, sana hindi yung yung citizen palaging palaging nagdidepend o nagaantay kung anong action ang gagawin ng kanyang pamahalaan para sa kanya. Mm -hmm. Pero yung uh, ano ang magagawa natin together so that yes, we will have the government that, that and parang it's like you get the government that you deserve. And so if you are vigilant, if you are engaged, if you participate, you are involved, then uh, we have all the reason to expect that uh, accountability will be promoted to its highest level and hopefully in the next generation. No? Uh, we will not talk of corruption anymore. <laughs> well, I wish you great luck yes, thank in the you work very that you much. do. Thank you, thank We've you. been speaking with Grace Polito Tan. She's the chair of uh, the Commission on Audit. Uh, she is, has a hotline if you have any tips. Yes, please. We have a number. Send it to her. Where's our number? Um, you can send your, your questions. You can tweet your questions at rappler.com and uh, to, at Tacoa as well. Mm -mm. Um, I'm Maria Ressa. Thank you for joining us.